Ooh. And we're back after like five months. Oh, it's good to be back. All right, guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel. And we are back out mountain biking once again. Oh, it's good to be back out. I have not been out riding in about five months. So uh, I reckon I might be a little it might take years to go back like get back into the riding style of things but uh you know it is what it is so out here at Majura today we be session in most of the downhill runs so uh, yeah should be good uh let's get, get right into it I reckon jump up here and hit planet claire over here to start us off Whew. Um, so I'm walking up to a Planet Claire, and they've got like all this, all this, all this, all this, all these jump trails. But they've been meaning to build a uh, pro line here, and they finally have. In the since last time I came out here, these jumps are huge. They're at least a solid ten foot jump. Oh, well, some of them. It's like you come off, you got a, a whale, a few whale tails. Oh, that's a shark fin. You got a whale tail, another whale tail in here. Then you got this. Look how steep that is, holy shit. Yeah, so that's the takeoff right there. And then, you know, your landings are right there. And then you got another one of them. They are massive, holy dooly. I expected the pro line to be like big, but not this big. All right, so you're probably wondering why I haven't been posting mountain bike videos or even riding lately. Uh, I remember the probably most common one that you would have seen it on, I my fishing charter one in Noosa. I actually uh, broke my wrist playing rugby so I had to have surgery and everything get plates and screws and all that stuff put in my wrist so I didn't end up riding uh, that actually happened if you look at my last mountain bike video that I posted the day of that ride the day after that ride sorry was the day I broke my wrist so yeah I was in cast and all that for weeks on end I've only just started to get, started to do like a lot of waist stuff with the wrist and all that. So I wasn't allowed to ride because of, especially with all the bouncing that happens when mountain biking. Um, been putting too much tension on my wrist. But I'm allowed to ride now. That's why I'm out here. I want to make the most of it. I didn't want to go to Stromlo first because I just didn't want to, obviously Stromlo is a lot more difficult. So I wanted to just warm up here at Madura, uh, get used to things and all that. So yeah. Yeah, so that's the story of why I haven't been riding for like a few months now. All right, let's get it. First run, first run. Oh, we're gonna be taking the winery trail, gonna go green coat and all that, so uh, yeah. Oh, also there's like, I don't know if you can see that, but like, that's the place where I had my wrist cut for our surgery and all that, so yeah. Just, I don't know, you guys probably didn't care about that, but I'm just saying. Anyway, let's get it. Ah, gonna obviously take it a little easy, just cause um, so I can get back into the groove of things. Oh, muddy. Yeah, so we've been getting a lot of rain here in Canberra recently, even though it's November, but it feels like winter time. Ah, uh, so. I reckon it's going to be pretty muddy in here like it always is in Madura after a lot of rain, so... Let's see how we go. Wrist is feeling... Ooh. Wrist is feeling relatively good so far. Which you love to see. Oh, 
Oh, oh shit. Let's see how this creek is water-wise. Oh, it's actually mud, not just water. Oh, and it's flowing quick. Oh. Oh. Back wheel got caught in the mud. Oh, my seat's muddy, I can feel it. Oh, yuck. Oh, grass is long through here. Hey, yo. Holy shit. Oh, that's flowing quick. Well, what a wet way to start. Oh, Ooh. there you go. First run back. First feels good. Oh, muddy as hell. Let's get going. All right, so I was going to hit Radical, but you can see that it's obviously closed due to the weather and it's probably just been absolutely destroyed. So we're going to hit Wombat, but Wombat's really boring, so I'm not going to film it. So I'm just going to cut straight to the next trail, which is probably going to be um in a banya. So yeah, that sucks. I actually kind of really did want to hit Radical, but you know what? It is what it is. Yeah, so here at uh, Inabanya, uh, we're just at the uphill part of it, but I'm um, about to drop into the downhill section. Oh, I was riding on bloody wombat. Freaking mosquitoes are everywhere. Look at them. Um, and I drove through, rode through mud. Uh, look at that. That is disgusting. It's fair. I got all over my shoes as well. Uh, anyway, shit happens, I guess. Anyway, I want to get going because these mosquitoes are annoying the crap out of me. Anyway, oh, it's muddy. Dropping into Inner Banya. What the? F Holy shit! So that has definitely just fallen down by accident. That's not meant to be here. Holy dooey, look at them all. Just from the wind and the rain that we've been getting lately here. Oh. oh, yuck. Yuck. Oh, no. Oh shit. <sighs> Bloody mozzies. Oh, Jesus Christ. 
I feel like I'm doing more stopping on that. Oh. I feel like I'm doing more st stopping on these trails and actually riding them. Why is this, how is this park open to be honest? Oh, we do it. So we're uh, making our way up here. We're uh, you know, like Planet Clare and all that's on that side of the park where all the real downhill trails are uh, so how's that a few weeks ago I went to a, on a, on a family holiday we went to Southwest Rocks which is around Port Macquarie in New South Wales and I obviously took the bike it was the first time I had, like started at least riding the bike just like casual riding uh, since my broken wrist but uh while we were there, the uh, chain, like the whole earring system, was like playing up a fair bit. The ch chain had kept on falling off, like the um, sort of, oh, I forgot what the word is, but like the thing that uh, I'll just point it out, kept on falling off uh, this thing down here, in there. Uh, so when we got back, Took it into pushies here in Fishwick and uh, that turned up like getting a whole new gearing system put on because the one was just cactus. So, um, yeah, I guess things happen with the bike, I guess, but um, no, it's fixed now, it's uh, feeling good and all that, so so far, no problems with it in this ride, but uh, yeah, dropping into. You know what, I can't even get down that part. Looks like we have to go and just drop into it this way. Uh, I think it's Larry's. Off the top of my head. AJ's Leap, sorry. Uh, my bad. No. Whammy. Whammy, that's the name. Got it third time. A bit muddy down here, but it's pretty good. Oh, oh. Way. Huh. First real technical trail. That felt good. That's what I love. Oh. And I don't love that though. So we're at uh, the start of Barry and Rock Lobster finally. Just coming down, start of it, and taking a look at this sort of step off here. Look, it doesn't look like much, but I reckon you get some real good air time. My goal uh, for this run, with my hint in this, I'm going to try and hit it. But I want to get my back wheel to land there. So I reckon I can get enough speed and this straight to um, make that achievable. So, yeah. Thought I'd just show you guys that and... Uh, yeah, let's, let's give it a go and send it. All right, let's give that little step off thing a go. Send to the right gear. Okay, well my front wheel made it. 
my font reel made it but uh back wheel didn't so yeah well i think it was because i uh definitely i started off in a terrible gear so i did into the right gear and that really slowed me down so oh well let's continue so we're jumping into barry this run Uh, I reckon we'll just stop at the bottom, I reckon. I cannot go the full way after Planet Claire. That's gotten a little tight. That's rotted in big time. So can we stop here at Planet Clear? Right, let's continue on to Planet Clear. First time hitting this iconic trail out here. Oh, that's a little new. Oh yes, love that little step up off to the side. So fast this trail. Oh yes, love to see it. Climate clear. Walking up, walking up to start a barry and rock lobster and all that. You might have already noticed that I've got some new mountain bike shoes and like actual proper mountain bike shoes now. So I was originally just wearing like hiking boots and like hiking shoes and they had terrible grip. So I was constantly slipping off the pedals and everything but got some proper secondhand mountain bike shoes and so far they've been working like a charm so it's just so I just catch my breath yeah they've been good so far so uh, back up here again and we're dropping into our rock lobster this time. So, let's get it. Alrighty, the rock lobster. Oh, that was nice and sketch. Oh, it's muddy through here. Now I've had to um, I cut a, cut a bunch of trees. Like look at it all. Oh, to uh, clear, make room for the trails and everything. 
This park had to have been closed for a bit, surely. Because I feel like every trail has been affected by the rain and the wind and every all of that. Oh, dodge that. I'm starting to get into my groove now. I've hit a few runs. Ooh, that's rock lobster done. Oh. Yuck. This is my ultimate test for the day. Uh, downhill. I've, always, I've hit this before, but you know, it is called downhill for a reason. So, yep, let's see how we go. Holy shit, what the hell? It is overgrown in here. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, that was, that's obviously like, that is the hardest part of this trail done. I did that pretty much with it being covered in grass. But you know, we did it. <laughs> Look how steep this is. I love this trail though so much. It's just up my alley. Oh, holy dooly. We did it. That was my ultimate test for the day. And I, I was that succeeded pretty well. Whew. All right, so I thought I'd just end the video off with one more run. Ah, oh, down Planet Claire here. Nice, quick, easy run. Oh, it's a fun one. I feel like they've gotten these jumps a little bit bigger. Yeah, I don't know, that might just be me. Who knows? Oh, it's such a good tabletop, that one. I'm gonna continue on actually.
Usually I'd go to the right, but it's closed. So it looks like we're going to the left. All right, guys. I reckon I'm going to call it a day here. Um, Dad here at Majora. Good to be back out riding. Uh, obviously, I said it's been nearly a good half a year, to be honest, actually. But um, yeah, wrist felt good while riding today, which is uh, always a good sign after having to have surgery and stuff on it. Um, keen to get back out riding again more often now. I'm coming to the end of my school career, which means I might hopefully have a bit more free time. I might be able to go out riding a bit more and get some more awesome videos for you guys. Uh, so stay tuned for those, obviously. Also looking at uh, working at a local bike store uh, here in Canberra. Looking at you know, jump pushies. So if you do live in Canberra, um, you might see me and you're into obviously mountain biking. You might see me around pushies pretty soon. So uh, yeah, anyway, I'm going to leave it on that note. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't already, make sure to go down and subscribe uh, for more content like this one. And I guess I'll see you legends uh, in the next video. So, see you later guys. Bye bye.